<sighs> Morning. So tired. Never knew school can be very life threatening. Hey, Roxy. I just wanted to ask Are the police done with the stupid search warrant? Yeah, they're done with it. But the only problem is that they took most of my small stuff. Yeah, I can really tell. Well, there, is there a way to get it back? No, the police has it and they locked it up. How do I get it? How do I even get it back? Simple. You just try, sneak into the police department, try to find the key that matches the door, unlock it, and then voila, you got your stuff back. And what about an escape route? That I didn't even think about. Yeah, nice. I'm gonna be hanging off to class later. She's totally targeted, right? I don't know, it looks like Ace targeting her directly. Well, let's just get to class. We don't wanna be late. Sure, okay. Oh, it looks like Roxy's in trouble with the FBI. How hilarious. Fancy seeing you here. Nice to see you here too. What are you doing here? Just setting up for a drama class. Oh, nice. Are you the movers man or something? No. Are you agreeing an attitude with me? Why? Well, to be honest, I can sense that you're very guilty. How guilty? I know there's something inside you that's keeping you and Jade away. There's a dark secret that I already know. You already made out with Leora, didn't you? <laughs> that was a long time ago. Besides, we broke up after she got psychotic. Did Jade tell you? No, I never knew that. So you're saying that Leora was psychotic before when you two dated? Yes. She was very psychotic and she tried to kill me after she got revenge. I don't think I ever trust you. After what happened last night, you ruined my life. Hmm. Hmm. That's all you can think of? All uh, because of why me and Claude were at your house, and then in the end you decide to snitch on me? Looks like you got no answer for it. Hmm, looks like someone told you to do that. Maybe I can tell the police that it was all fraud and you try to frame me. Uh. Huh? If you tell one damn soul of what I did, you're gonna see the daylights out of it. Is that a threat? Cause I don't even feel threatened about it. <sighs> Trying to get an attitude with me. And I seriously don't even care. Hey! What the hell? You laying a damn finger on her? <laughs> well, looks like I'll be leaving. <laughs> <sighs> that jackass. He didn't hurt you, didn't he? No. We were just having a talk. What kind of damn talk was it? It's nothing. Whatever. Class is about to start. We should set up the props. Hold it! Tell me, what did you two say? If you don't, I'm gonna get very pissed off. I'm gonna trash everything in this school. <sighs> Fine. We were talking about Leora and about what he did to me at the police. That's all. He didn't try to make a move on me or anything. You know, you're very, very easy to get targeted by. 
Well, that depends on how old I am. <laughs> Do you guys sense a problem going around them? Nah, they're just tired. They need more sleep. And why do you really suggest that they have problems when you have issues because you're so nosy? Hey guys! I am back. Joelle Chun! How are you doing? I'm fine. It looks like I'm out of the hospital. What are you guys standing here for looking over there? Dudes have some issues going around 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 them. Issues? What kind of issues? I don't know, I just sense there's a little problem. And Sasha complains that he's nuts. I am not. Why don't we just go talk to them? Oh, hey guys. Hey, Joelle, you're out of the hospital? Yep, I'm back. I'm fully recovered from my brain trauma. <laughs> That's good news. Well, what do you guys want? We just want to explain something's going on, you know? Um, well, it seems like you three have been neglecting us and haven't even spoken to us. Is something wrong? No, nothing's wrong. Well, we've been very busy. What kind of busy things that you can have in common? Work, homework, life, projects, school, yeah. Those are the things that are very tough around here. I know, right, Kumi? You guys don't have to worry about us. There's nothing wrong with us. Are you sure? Because I can sense a lot of positively negative stuff around you all. It's nothing, okay, guys? You guys, you guys don't have to worry about it. I gotta go. Me too. Me three. Later. Heh. <laughs> Smooth moves, snake boy. I can just sense a problem going on. Well, your problem, it didn't work, okay? The, what if something's going on with them? Like, they, like, like, they're gonna get ran over by a bus. What are you gonna do? Whatever, you all can just blame me, but I, just, I can just tell there's something going on with them. I don't know about you guys, but I can sense it too. So it looks like Deuce is the only one. Uh, is something going on here like I don't even know? I don't know, because I'm hanging out with two of the weirdest psychotic people in the world. I don't know, because I'm sensing there's a lot of logical explanation about the YouTube because you're so psychic. <sighs> that was a close one, I know. We almost got busted. We promise not to tell anyone. If we do tell, A's gonna hurt one of them. And the next person who, who A strikes can be near our friends. So far, it looks like A could have attacked Kumi with a car in, on her vacation and Joelle with the tr brain trauma thing. Next up, it could, be, it, could, it could be either Carrie or Deuce. We must keep an eye on them. We don't want them to get hurt. Better keep them in a safe place. You don't want me striking them. A. Yeah, we need to protect them. By not telling what we're doing. We must keep this a secret. All four of us. Including Roxy. Got it. Okay. Just hope they don't act suspicious about it. <sighs> I can't believe class can be so overwhelming. I don't even know how to get my grades up. It's just like, they're just brushing it through to make us all learn it all better. <sighs> well, I'm just glad that I'll be able to spend my time up, up on the roof. Ah, kimochi, kimochi. I sense there's someone next to me. Oh, Jade. Fancy meeting you here. Uh, what are you doing up here? Uh, I'm so sorry. Am I, am I really, like, disturbing you? I'm sorry. I'll leave. No, wait. I want to have a talk with you. 
Oh, damn it. Okay. Um, what do you want to talk? Uh, do you trust me? What? I'm saying, do you trust me? Why? What? Why are you saying that? I had a run in with your friend Roxy. And it seems like she doesn't trust me about, you know, what I told you about Liara, huh? Yeah. She thinks I'm the one to blame. She doesn't. Trust me, very trustworthy. And it seems like your closest friends don't trust me either. But you trust me, right? Uh, well, um, t to be honest, um, I don't know if I can trust you, Jackson. But, I told you everything. Don't you trust me a little bit? Well, Jackson, part, part of me does want to trust you, but part of me wants to protect my friends. And I don't know if you did date Lior a long time and you did tell me the truth, but I don't know. I'm sorry, Jackson. I gotta go. Why did I have to screw everything up? Huh. I'm sorry, Jackson. I don't know if I can trust you anymore.